Investigators say on Monday, four tourists were driving in the Manoa area when they were stopped by a black Mercedes SUV with four people inside. Two men got out, one armed with a handgun, and demanded the victim's property. The victims gave up their stuff, and the suspects took off. One of the suspects, Watson, was later identified and arrested. He's been charged with robbery. His bail set at $250,000. Meanwhile, the convicted felon accused of shooting a man Monday morning in Mealy Lani is also expected in court today after being charged with attempted murder, robbery, auto theft, and firearm offenses. Isaiah Kaisa remains in custody on $500,000 bail. A witness who was in the passenger seat of a truck told us two masked men approached them and asked for their belongings. But when the driver refused, that's when one of them shot him in the stomach. Happening now, state sheriff and Honolulu police are looking for a missing women's community correctional center inmate. Authorities say 33-year-old Brandy Ho failed to return to the facility from her furlough program pass. She is five foot three. 86 pounds with brown hair and brown eyes. She's serving time for forgery and theft and will now face escape charges. If you've seen Brandy Ho, call 911. Honolulu police are also asking for help finding a robbery suspect. Authorities say on July 24th, this man followed another person into the restroom at the Kentucky Fried Chicken restaurant in Waikele, assaulted them, and took their property. The suspect then ran off. If you recognize him, please call Crime Stoppers at 955 8300.